Today is a big day in America. It is National Punctuation Day. Oh. National Punctuation Day. Now, you might say to yourself, what the hell is National, National <laughs> Punctuation Day? It is a celebration a punctuation and a day to promote the correct usage of punctuation. And so National Punctuation Day, it couldn't have come at a better time because I found out from comedian Kevon on stage, Kev on stage, excuse me, that punctuation does not mean the same as it used to. These kids today, they, and y'all know this, you got kids, they've changed the meanings of our punctuation. So Kev on stage showed a video showing us what he thought, uh, what his niece thought about how the kids are texting. Take a look. Oh, the kids is using punctuation differently through text message. I'm telling you so I can help you with the babies, the Gen Z and the like. Okay, so I'm talking to my niece and I say thank you, period. Don't think nothing of it. So she sent me a voice note. She's like, Unk, let me tell you, because uh, you probably don't know this because you're old. True. She was like, when we text, you know, people my age, if you say period, then that means get out my phone. I'm done talking to you. And I was like, okay, like the word period or the punctuation? She's like, the punctuation. When I end my stuff, I need to see that period at the end so you know my sentence over. But these kids is different out here in the new world. They born after 2000. When I tell you, I can't... Yeah, Kev, I love you. So we gotta have Kev on the on our Laugh Lounge. He's so good in the Laugh Lounge. He's yes. so funny. But these kids don't use periods now when they text you. What in the world is going on? And so some of the younger people on my staff, they said they don't use periods in, they te in their text. So I said, what, are you just using run-on sentences? And they said, this is what they said. They said they don't do a, a full sentences. They text each sentence individually so they don't need a period. So now I got all of these dings and individual texts <laughs> on my phone. Let me tell you something about me. I not only use proper punctuation in my text, I write in full paragraphs. <laughs> like, that's what I do. Do y'all do full <laughs> paragraphs? I write. I don't press sin until I'm done with my full thoughts. And then I asked these kids, I said, well, what about the exclamation point? And they, do you know these kids have the audacity to say, if I use exclamation points in a text, I'm asking for a fight. That's what they meant. <laughs> I said, if I'm asking for a fight, then what do I use when I'm joyful and I'm happy? And you know what they said? They said, don't use an exclamation point, use an emoji. Oh. That's what they, so basically these kids running around today, they just can't be happy. That's what it is. They, <laughs> And I go, and this is why I'm having the problems I have with my 19-year-old son, the way he is. I feel like, uh, I feel like the art of the written word is getting lost mm -hmm. because everybody's always abbreviating and emojiing to, ex to articulate their feelings. And then they can't talk to you when they're not on that phone. When my, nef my nephews and my nieces, they send a text to me sometimes and the text will just say, auntie. That's it, auntie. <laughs> now, what that text really means is auntie, Something happened, okay? Uh, then it's the next sentence. Can you cash at me some money? <laughs> the next sentence, right away. I'll be waiting for it. <laughs> Don't tell my mama. <laughs> Where's it at? <laughs> Did you send it yet? <laughs> that's what auntie means. Uh, that's what I have to decipher in my mind. That's all, they never type that. It's just auntie. And it always have a bunch of emojis after it. And it also means, auntie also means, and I'm not gonna call you when I get the money and say thank you, but I got it, I love you. That's what auntie means. <laughs> and I gotta tell y'all, I'm, I'm so tired of all of these emojis. I'm, it's just too many emojis that you gotta go scroll through. I'm tired of that laughing emoji. I have to tell you, I don't like that laughing emoji. <laughs> I'm tired of that crying emoji, the one you gotta put. And th there's one, this one is this smiling and crying at the same time. So, I, you know, this one, I don't know if this one is crying or crying laughing. What does it mean? I don't know, it, they one got one, it's, I thought it was the prayer hands. I really thought it was the prayer hands, but I don't know if the prayer hand, I, I don't even know what this one looked like right here. Prayer hands or is it high-fiving you? So, I, the emojis I'm tired of. Then I gotta, you know when you do the emojis, they got them in five or six different colors. Yep. Yeah. So now I gotta figure out what color the emoji is. <laughs> I'm trying to scroll through. I keep sending the wrong emoji. I never get the right 
uh, color for the emo I just use the light skin emoji. That's the one I just, <laughs> I just stick with that one. So I just say, kiddos, will y'all please start using punctuation? It, they, they got punctuation for a reason. So would y'all just please for the aunties, start the uncles, start using punctuation. Happy punctuation day. We're gonna have a good time.